Hello guys, welcome to Adota Cassava Farm. Yes, we are in Adota Farm right now. You know, today I just decided to take my time to come to our farm today. So I'll be showing you guys a lot in this farm today. Like like one of my videos I just showed, I told I told you guys about how our goat farm has been doing well. So right now we are in our cassava farm right now. Adota has a cassava farm. You know we are in the rainy season time, so different crops are being planted this rainy season time. So right now we planted our cassava right now. So we planted this cassava and I tried to show you how the cassava are growing. Like the video that I just showed before I came up to start my speech right now is how the cassava has been doing well. So I would ask the person that is taking care of this farm for us that how how, how month old is this? cassava right now and, there, and when do they plant this cassava so that is the question that i'll be asking them and we'll be showing you guys the the i mean the, the, the type of chemicals that they have been using in this farm or for, for now so we are, we are we are going to show you the chemical so you will see it in case if you want to start something like this in your so farm like i said i'll be showing you the chemicals that we are using in this farm already these three chemicals that are hold on my hand right now if you can see very clearly are the chemicals that we used to fumigate this particular farm and like i asked on the person that has been taking care of this farm for us he said this particular cassava farm is just three weeks but due to that that, that the rain is not falling that much so that was the reason why this cassava have not grown more than this level that there is and about right now the rain is at least coming down much now than ever before so these are the chemicals that we use in this farm and this farm is just three weeks so and the cassava has been doing well also so i will advise you to my subscriber out there the cassava farm is lucrative in nigeria if only you can go into cassava farm you are going to make money from cassava business in nigeria and and what you need to know about this cassava I uh, just few things like few guidelines I need to know about this cassava. Number one thing is to get select a cassava or, 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 or just select a stem that is the, the right varieties of cassava to, to plant. Select a very good stem. Then get a farmland. Get a farmland you can construct it like in this particular farm you use tractor to construct it. You know this land is more than two acres, three acres of land so it's a very big farm. So we use tractor to, or to, to cultivate this land for us. So if you can start something like this, you know, you can start with two acres of land, one acres of land, even the plot of land. So depending on the amount of money that you have. So cassava business is lucrative. If you go into it, you are going to enjoy it. You enjoy it. Like I said, you enjoy it. And you know, we obtain different products from cassava. We can use cassava as a gari, can turn it into gari. And you know, we have a gari factory in Nigeria. We can turn it into fufu, like people usually eat fufu. You know, some people turn the, 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 the I mean, cassava product into a bar, like, you know, so there are different products to be obtained from cassava there are different things that you can obtain from cassava if only you can go into cassava business in nigeria i know like i said it's a rainy season time so start up something start it from anywhere and you all you just need to do is to just be maintaining it and focus on the farm that you're doing and in the nearest future you are going to make more money from your business so please if you are new in this channel don't forget to subscribe to adota farm and do well to turn on the notification bell so as to get notified when next we drop a new video for you like this and do well to come please drop your comments and we'll always answer you and bye for now